never be surprised to see him come up with some stuff and put it right into play. Here's the first hit of the day for the River Hawks. First baseman Steve Pass the tempo sends it out to right field. A one out single. It was a good swing right there. Just the 0 2 on the way. Challenged him with the high heat. Climo couldn't catch up to it. First strike out of the game for Delatry. He's pulling center field. Bush going to go after the first pitch. It's a fastball ripped down the right field line. He's looking for two. He's going to try and stretch it. The throw into the bag in time. Martin with a one hopper able to cut down Bush. A single for the, the left fielder, but two away in the inning. His counts in the, you know, just like that, Sabato got a fastball that he wanted to hit. Ooh. Hesterly got a fastball as well. Rockets this one out to right center field. North Carolina with a one nothing lead. Yeah, that was a pretty good swing right there, but a fastball a little bit over, and I'd say middle, middle, you know. Right down Franklin Street. <laughs> Hesterly with his first home run of the season. Picks up RBI number five. 11th home run of the year for the Tar Heels. That one waist high right in the power zone for the lefty. You could almost see his eyes get big in that, <laughs> in that replay. <laughs> it's coming into you. It just kind of comes into the barrel. And that's not necessarily a oof. Harris hammers this one towards right field. Young looking up. Excuse me, Martin looking up. It's going to short hop the wall. Harris. Standing at second with a one-out double. And Dylan can roll, can he? <laughs> Bush puts this one out into center field. Coach Fox going to hold Harris up coming to third base. The Tar Heels with runners at the corners here in the third. The bats. <laughs> the one-two to McGee. Bush started to take off. McGee swings over top of the breaker. Second out of the inning. Big strikeout there for Rand, his first of the game. That's really Mike good. Freeman for Carolina now. Goes after the first pitch. Fastball out into center field. And caught by Young. Despite after the first one, he's going to have himself another hit into the right center field gap. Roberts goes first to third. And for the second inning in a row, Carolina with runners at the corners and one away. Here's the 2-2 two -two to Soretti. Hard hit on the ground. Backhanded by the shortstop to second for one across the diamond. There's the double play ball they needed. A 6-4-3. The other two do up in the inning for Carolina. Chopper towards the shirt stop, shortstop to Mosa. The throw off the line. That's a tempo. Not able to get that tag down as it pulled him off the bag. The error on the shortstop will give the Tar Heels the leadoff man. Yeah, for the surprise, though. Since Carolina has stranded runners to maybe see them put him in motion, maybe get a hit and run with the lefty uh, up at the plate. Yep, test the arm. McGee extended his on base streak. There is the hit and run. He went opposite field. It'll still work, though. Harris to second. Bush, excuse me, McGee on first. Tar Heels with two on and one out again here in the field. I think right here, if you're UNC, you're going to have to almost sit breaking ball. You know, it's, it's getting where that may be what it takes if you're going to drive a ball. 1-1. One, one. Out into right field. Martin tried to throw up the deep. Coach Fox going to hold the runner. Harris at third. The ball up the line. Big pitch here. Probably the biggest of the game for Rand. The 3-2. Off speed. Roberts able to check the swing. He's going to draw the bases loaded walk. That'll make it a 2-0 Carolina lead. He's aiming the fastball and he's throwing the curve. 3-2, out in front off the end of the bat. Into foul territory goes Marchena. Second baseman's going to make the catch. It'll give a look for McGee at third. He's not going to go anywhere as that one got just out of the infield. A one big chopper towards McGee. Third baseman will throw a strike across the diamond. And that'll do it for the sixth. A double from Tomosa, but Delatry able to pitch around it. Be a big deal mm -hmm. for them right now, especially facing the quality of the teams. Ooh, Payoff pitch back. ripped into the right center field gap by Soretti. Big turnaround first. He'll put on the brakes and head back with a one-out single. Three of them in a row that he's going to face here. Dylan Harris, Michael Bush, and Ashton McGee. There goes the runner from first to hit and run, and dead to rights is Soretti. Thrown out at second base. That'll help a pitcher out. It's a new one. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to come out with the 
That thing looked like a split finger. 0-2 oh, right up the middle from Harris. He's going to be aboard with his second hit of the day. Left fielder number 15. Curveball, bouncer off the third baseman, Gallagher. A couple are going to score for the heels. In from second is Harris. Holding up at third will be McGee. Two across. Carolina has doubled their lead. It's 4-0 Tar Heels. Last four Tar Heel batters have been walked by Riverhawk pitchers. And now Kasparius is going to take one right in the middle of that four. That'll drive in the fifth run of the game. 5-0 for the Heels. One, two, rip down the first baseline and just foul. By about a foot. Window if UMass is able to get out of it. Mm -hmm. Three, two, swing and a miss. Hester Lee goes down swinging with the bases loaded, but the Tar Heels able to put up three in the Good inning. Question. Back to back top 10 teams. It was Georgia last week, and now the Heels. Delatry going to pick up his fifth strike out of the game. Starters, the openers, right? And you've just got a lot of stuff going on right now that because the analytics guys are saying this works, this helps. Easy fly ball out to right field. Two quick a lot outs. Of different uh, possibilities come up. Here's the eighth pitch of the at bat from Delatry. That one should get him out of the inning. Popped up on the infield. He makes the catch. Again. Yeah, I totally agree. I think it's one of those things where those guys have. Hard hit ball past the diving first baseman and into the corner. Soretti into second looking for third. Coach Fox standing right on that line saying, hold up there, young man. Second hit of the game for Soretti. That's two big base hits for him. Very interesting game how you go to Fenway and have to pitch kind of differently because of how it goes. Bouncer in front of Bush. Fielded, though, cleanly by Marchin, and he'll be able to retire McGee. At well, first. just road baseball is different than, than, than just playing at home, which your park you're used to and in front of your own fans. Right at the first baseman. And it's Kasparius over there for the Tar Heels. Five strikeouts on the afternoon for Delatry. And that one's going to hit him. Came in and plunked him in the leg. Third base runner of the day. Here's the payoff pitch. Swung on and missed. O'Brien comes in and gets back-to-back -back outs. The Tar Heels are through seven and a half. They've got a 5 nothing Tomorrow, lead. A 10 a.m. first pitch. There's a 1-2 to Freeman. Right back up the middle off the feet of Pomeroy. And Ike going to be aboard with his third hit of the day. Now... You tell me, but did Pomeroy intentionally keep his leg down? It looked like he actually moved his foot in. Yeah, almost yeah. like it was a like a foot save right mm -hmm. here. Yeah, you could see him yeah. react with that. Yeah. In on the fist, a little dribbler. One out in the base pass. Runner going to be safe at second. Not a bad uh, play there by Freeman to hold Double up and work today. Well, and I wouldn't be surprised if Got it on his hands, too. Just past Pomeroy, the throw across from Tomosa in time. Nice play from the shortstop. Second out of the inning. Here's Hesterly. Two for two. A ball called. Yeah. He played umpire Steve Sanders came out. Darren Spignardi at third. They both agree. A double. It kind of makes you feel a little bit better. This one's to the first base side. Pass the tempo, gets it on the short hop, and steps on the bag himself. You know, I think he's thrown harder than anybody has today. Out to right field, Roberts on the run. He'll make the catch for the first out of the inning. You got it like that. That wasn't bad. Ilias was crossed up or not. 3 2, back up the middle. And Wilder going to make the play. Two away here in the ninth. Two, lifted out towards left field. Freeman, the shortstop out there. He'll call for it and make the catch. The Tar Heels lose their first game in the midweek. They come back and take this one by a score 
of five to nothing. A great outing from Gianluca Delatri.